Hello fellow Sudokans, welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Tuesday the 16th of January 2024, evening here in Bangkok. This is my game at bedtime. Well, it's quite an early bedtime for me, I must admit, but I'm, after, I'm feeling pretty tired, so off I go to the land of Nod in a mo. Um, good to have some positive news sometimes. I see there's a story in The Guardian about a 17-year-old in Hyderabad in India uh, who has come up with uh, an alarm, uh, patented it, and man is about to go into manufacturing, I think. This 17-year-old uh, who has come up with an alarm for... Um, people with um, Alzheimer's and dementia who couldn't wander off without, you know, unexpectedly or without uh, warning. And uh, this uh, device will send an alarm to uh, a caregiver to notify them that the person has uh, wandered off. So uh, he, apparently he taught himself uh, using YouTube videos. There we are. YouTube videos, tutorials, great stuff. I'm all in favor of them. Um uh, good luck to him and uh, let's hope the device is a success but let's hope the disease of Alzheimer's um, and dementia uh, gradually lessens um, although it's unlikely to as the planet is aging isn't it really um, and the older you get the more chance you have of suffering from this of course uh, it's a horrible thing uh, right, let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? This is the uh, Los Angeles Times expert level puzzle. We've got sixes blocking down here. That's what I noticed whilst chatting to you. And sixes across here and here and down there will give me a six in that square. We'll continue with the sixes going up <coughs> to put a six here. Okay, the one blocking down here puts one into one of these two squares, so this can't be one. And we have a one blocking down here, so that's a one. One going up here, across here, and across there. And then the ones to the bottom. Two down this way and across here, we'll put two into that square, two across here and across here, and there's a two. Uh, okay, 2 and 8 block this square because 2 and 8 must be in these squares here. We need 2 and 8 for these squares. This is going to be a 3 to complete the column. Five blocking up here puts five into that square. Missing numbers here and here are four and something. There's a blocking four. What is the something? The something is a nine. <clears throat> uh, 
Uh, can, might be able to work this stuff out. No, maybe not. Let's see, what is this? Um, two and eight. Yes, because it was. We had two and eight there. So two and eight. So we're looking for three, seven, nine in these squares. So seven blocking up there. There's the seven. And three and nine here. So this is going to be uh, four. Four across here, four down there. There's four. Uh, five across here. There's a five. One down here. There's our one. And the missing digit here is an eight. At this end, we need a. No, I was going to say nine. No, we don't need a nine. Uh, we need a three. Also got a three blocking here. There's a three, and this will be an eight. I think I might go through the digits in just a tick. No, nope. I've got four across here and across here and a four going up there, so I can place a four there. <coughs> Now I'm going to go through the digits.
Um, okay, I'm going to put in pencil marks and finish the game now. I was spending all night playing the game. <coughs> so, uh, missing from here, <coughs> excuse me, four or five ones in these squares. <coughs> Sevens go anywhere, and eights go in those squares. the other number here eight isn't it and this is three nine <coughs> Uh, okay, I think I'm just going to get on with it and finish the game off. Uh, so, where should we begin? Across the middle, I suppose. Uh, ones. Ah, is that one two eight? Yes, it is. I see it. One two eight blocking across here. One two eight blocking up here. This has to be one two and eight in those squares. So I can get rid of that um, candidate seven, and also that candidate three. That's no good. And uh, so that's one two and eight. That's okay now. Three seven, and the missing number here is nine. So nine blocks there. That's going to be nine in those squares there and nine will be blocking up here across there and up here so that will give us a nine to place here and then nine across here and across there and a nine up there there's our nine get rid of the nines down there <coughs> uh, so we've got a pair of two and eight here then so that's going to be a one so this would be a 7 and 
Let's get rid of the sevens first of all. And let's get rid of the one here and there. Yeah, that looks okay. Uh, now we've also got a pair of three and nine in this row, so we can get rid of those threes now. And this nine. And we're left with one, five, and six, three numbers in three squares there, and three, four, and nine up in these squares like that that looks okay that looks okay yes yes I say that's looking fine I've got a seven here this can't be a seven now Okay, missing digits in this column are 1, 5, and 8. 1 and 5 block this square. That's going to be an 8. And it means that this must be our 8 down here. So we have 1 there and a 7 there. 7 blocking up here and across there. Put 7 into that square. 7 across here and across there means that's a 7. Here's a 5. And... 5 blocking across here and there and there's our 5 gives us 5 down here with a 4 there 4 in that square 3 is there 9 is here uh, 9 is in that square 9 is here 3 is there and this is a 5 6 with a one here. Uh, what's missing from this column? S not seven. Uh, is it a, f a three? Yes. Three there. Three across here. Three up there. So that puts a three in that square. Uh, this has to be a six. And this has to be a two. Two there. And we're looking for an 8 in this square. So 2 there, 8 there. 2 there, 8 there. And we have 3, so this is our 7. And 3 finishes the game, so not too tough with a couple of pencil marks. Uh, without it, though, I can't go forward. Okay, uh, I'll see you tomorrow, hopefully. Although I've got a lot of work tomorrow, but I'll do my best to get in a couple of games. Bye-bye.